Hey guys, I'm Chris. Welcome to Show Me the Hogs. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a Carolina rig. The type of fish this rig will catch, you name it, it'll catch it. Whether it's catfish, bass, walleye, it doesn't matter. The Carolina rig will help you catch it. And the type of line you're going to be using, it doesn't really matter. It can be mono, floral, braid. They all work with a Carolina rig. The important thing to remember though is with the line is that your leader needs to be lighter than your main line. Now the rig I'm going to be building today is going to be for catfish. And this is going to be, the leader is going to be 40 pound fluorocarbon. And my main line is 65 pound fluorocarbon. And the reason for that is if I ever get hung up on a rock or a tree and I need to snap the line, theoretically, this lighter line is going to break before my heavier main line. The only thing I'm really going to lose is my leader and my hook. Save my lead and my swivel and my bead. So let's get to it. All right, I'm gonna clip off a little of this main line here that's kind of crooked. And I'm gonna take my no roll sinker here, thread over the main line. And now I've got a bead. And this, the importance of a bead, it's gonna act as a buffer between the lead and the knot tied to the barrel swivel. If that lead is constantly bumping up against the knot tied to the barrel swivel, it could compromise the knot and God forbid, you would lose a fish if that knot was at all damaged in any way. So that's why that bead's there. And the knots I'm gonna be using, two of the three knots on this rig are going to be polymer knots. And if you guys want more detail of how to tie these knots, I suggest you click the right hand link to visit our fishing knots tutorial playlist that we're constantly adding to all right so that's our first polymer knot i'm going to pull in the tag in here to make sure it's good and secure all right looks good to me now we're going to clip off our tag end here great main line is done now on to the leader. Now the leader, I aim for about, depending on the day, six inches to two feet. I feel like if it's more than two feet, it's just getting excessive. So I'm gonna tie another polymer knot for the hook. Thread this through. Overhand knot. Loop it around the, the hook bend here. And pull it tight. All right. I love the polymer knot, guys. It is an amazing knot. Cannot recommend it enough. It, uh, unlike other knots, I've never had a polymer knot, to my knowledge, fail on me. I'm gonna clip off the tag end. And now we're gonna tie this onto the barrel swivel and. The, complete the rig. So now I will not be able to complete a polymer knot because now that it's tied onto the main line there's no way that I can loop the leader around the barrel swivel. So my next go-to knot is an improved clinch knot. Wrap that around the line a few times. Run the tag in through one loop, through another loop. Pull it tight. Bam. Clip off the tag end. And now we have ourselves a gorgeous Carolina rig. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'd really appreciate it if you consider subscribing. Check out some of the other videos on our channel. We're also on Instagram and Facebook, so check us out in those places. We'll see you in the next video, guys. Thanks for watching.